Hello everybody, and welcome to episode 9 of the Tamagotchi Bunch here. So, let's get on to the Tamas themselves real quickly, which, as you see there, they're doing weird little animations. It is close to night, so that actually has a little night animation there, which is really cool. Uh, we only have one, oh, take them to the toilet. Yes, the toilet function is still in these devices, by the way. You can actually sit there, and if they make a weird face and stand still, that usually just means they're pooping. So, enjoy that. Probably need to clean up the poop one more time, though. But yep, we got the one Tamagotchi right there. We got their bonds up to 10%. I've been trying to learn the games, which I'm sort of learning. I've gotten better at them. Uh, they are pretty, actually, the bond games are pretty easy. But the issue with the bond games is they don't raise your happiness meter up. So, they're kind of weird. They... They're supposedly supposed to raise bonds, but I have not gotten that to happen yet. Because remember, this is our first actual day of like true bonding with them. So we did actually raise up our bonds to 10%, which is actually pretty good. Because last time we didn't even raise them up by whatever percentage for a few days, to be honest. So I've, I've learned how to slightly do this. Um, you probably need to sit down and play games with them in just a minute. Uh, we did actually buy one item on this side, so I guess we will show that off though. Going to Souvenir, and we bought this weird Venarian glass thing. Don't know what it was, but since I'm making money off the Bond games, because it's actually kind of easy to sit down and play, I can actually go through the games. I've actually beaten the games a bunch of times at this point. I'm not going to beat them on camera, because I suck at doing this on camera. But overall, they are doing really nice. We had a cool little Star Boy, which apparently on the V5, if you get this guy, he's a cool rare thing. I don't know if that's the same occasion for the 5.5 so i guess we'll find out over evolution and stuff like that so pretty interesting stuff here on the other side we still have the same night animation but we got the two tamagotchis so i've actually learned something pretty interesting about these two uh tamas right here is it's actually kind of uncommon to get two of a uh what was it uh mixed family or whatever so that's a cool thing someone was explained to me that they Probably gonna have to go update the whip, uh, wiki because of that. Because uh have video evidence of me doing the whole marriage process and stuff like that and seeing how it works. So it is pretty cool to have a slight little change to things. But yeah, they are, this is apparently a nice little uncommon thing, which is pretty cool. Didn't know that it was uncommon. I'm gonna give them some meals though. Let's see. And I did connect them earlier today, so that means we actually got a mushroom. And did you see the parents? Oh, it's such a cool thing. Doing it one more thing, because... Oh, yeah. I don't know why we're giving it a mushroom. I don't even know what this mushroom does, by the way. It's a weird-looking mushroom. Okay, no, they're done eating. But overall, they are doing pretty well. I'm going to give them two snacks, because it is very close to bedtime. So that's like... Ugh. We'll do we'll do three. And I'll probably play one mini game with them. But there's one thing I do want to show off, because I did get something cool in. Um, so, let's do a mini game here. Uh, which one are we doing? Uh, we want to do one of these four games right here, because that's what's going to give us the little point for happiness and stuff like that. So, let's get on to that. That's a bye. Or a wasp. I don't know what that's supposed to be. I wonder what that's supposed to be like representing. The idea of them talking like bugs or whatever. I get the like envelopes that's like fan mail or whatever, because remember these guys are supposed to be like celebrities or something like that. So I wonder what the bugs are supposed to mean. Like it's supposed to be like fan mail and autograph, fan mail, autograph. Or, like is it supposed to represent like them bugging you or something like that? I don't understand. I'm not very into the whole paparazzi culture, so I guess that's just me being a bit of a, a bit of an idiot in this situation. But uh, overall, it's pretty cool. I do actually like the mini games in this one. I will say the 5.5. If you do have a choice between version five and 5.5, um, 5.5 I've actually kind of liked a bit more. The mini game variety and stuff like that is really nice, and the uh, two extra mini games you get from the whole like second generation or whatever. Is also pretty cool. I really like a lot of the uh, stuff they've introduced. It's very interesting to see what everything's in. So now it's going to start going faster. 
or 25. 26. Oh, I messed up because I was trying to go too quick. But we got 500 gotcha points for that. I've also realized a lot of the items in this one are way cheaper than the other device. So, in a way, th this one's kind of a, an easier mode, I guess you can say. I don't know. It's also very undocumented, so you will not find, like, your codes and stuff like that through this device. So, uh, don't expect, like, fancy code entering stuff, apparently. I was told that by people when I was trying to learn how to fix the whole Laura thing. The, or, was it, was it Laura? No, is uh. Can we look at the thing? Let's see. Yeah, I can't look at memories. Okay, never mind. I was gonna try to look at it. But if you remember, in the last generation, we had the same three typing or whatever like that. There's a way to apparently fix that with an item. And because I was looking through how to fix it with items and stuff like that, um, kind of weird and stuff like that. So, there's supposed to be an item that fixes the whole, that whole one family issue. I don't know what the item is at this point. It's a food item, I think it is. Because, when someone was explaining to me how the version 5 did it, they said it was through food items. And I was like, okay. And that's just how it's supposed to work in a way. Don't know how it works on this one. There could be items or something like that. I don't know. Like I said, this device is very much undocumented in weird ways. So, hopefully... I can figure it out at some point. I did figure out how why they turned into all three, though. It's just if you get enough care mistakes, that's what happens, is they'll just become whatever family. Which is a very interesting concept. And I have been making money on this one, actually, because Golf Putt and the other game are pretty easy. We're trying to raise their happiness, though, currently, because that's just how this one works. So, do-do-do-boop-boop-boop-boop-boop. And there you go. I really don't like this mini game though. <laughs> this is like the one mini game where I'm like, ugh. Can I end at three? I don't know if it lets me end at three. Yes, it does. Okay, sweet. I like the other mini games way more on these devices. <laughs> Golf putt and shoot pairs is how I've been getting money recently on these ones. Golf putt's pretty interesting, uh, especially when you get to the later parts, because. How it, how it does the speed up or whatever, it's just by skipping frames, which is really funny to me. So it's pretty cool to see frame skipping and stuff like that in there. I haven't gotten good at shoe pairs. The idea of shoe pairs is just matching shoes, and I haven't really got sat down and messed around with it too much. Mostly because the golf one's pretty easy to do. I don't know if I'll be able to do it on camera, though, because my camera does have a slight bit of lag to it when I'm doing this. Let's see how far I can go with this. I haven't gone too far on this one because I haven't gotten used to the frame skipping yet at the later area. Because once it does start doing the whole frame skipping thing, I have not figured out where I'm supposed to perfectly land up. So, it's the joys because it stops taking this smooth slide over and does like a jittery thing. Which is pretty cool. This one is pretty easy to sit down and play, though, because... Oh, what's it doing? Okay, it's not that one. So that golf minigame does some weird mini uh, sounds, and doesn't, doesn't it? I don't know. I'm not used to... Oh, I messed that up. And there we go. I've gotten more money out of this, and that's how I've been kind of gaining money out of this device recently. This one's way harder to gain money out of than the other one. So it's kind of a pain in the butt there. But uh, hopefully I can get better at those mini games at least. Did I already lose a happiness art? Jeez. I'm going to give you a snack because I'm not in the mood to really play the other mini games with you. How much money we got, though? We got 750. I'm not going to buy anything on this one yet. From what I've experienced so far, the items on this one are stupidly expensive. <laughs> so I'm just going to hold off on spending on this one because it's just one of those things where it's like I'm not going to find too much of a use out of it yet. Uh, and this one went to bed, so I guess we can't even do that. 
but they're fine. Yes, it is bedtime for both these Tomas, so it is pretty cool. But the episode does not end here yet, because we actually have a bit of Tama mail. So, recently bought something from the Tamagotchi, uh, or the Texas group for Tamagotchi. I'll link them down below and stuff like that. I'll link their face, or not Facebook, their Instagram and their uh, Discord. I'll link both of those down. Because I recently got a cool deal from the, I think it's the owner of the server, it might be one of the moderators. I'm thinking it's owner, but uh, we made a whole deal for a cool little Tamagotchi thing. So let me show off the little extra bits real quickly. So here's one of the cool little extras. It's some Angel Gachi stickers. They're pretty cool. I love the look of them. Love the old Tamagotchi art style. It's pretty awesome. Especially these pooping ones. I don't know. I always love when the Angel Gachi is like one of my favorite devices. So it's just pretty cool to see a lot more of that stuff. They also threw in a little note. It just says, thank you for adopting this Tama. And that's the name of the person on the server. They go by something else on Discord, though. So I'm not going to say who they go by because I don't know if they want me to say that. That's not even their full name either. So it's just one of those things. I'm going to keep it for their sake of privacy. But uh, I will put down their information. But I will show off what I got from them. And we got a Devil Gachi. So, I've been, this is one of the like, coolest Tamagotchis. And I was super excited to get it. They let me do a whole, like, uh, payment thing for it. So, I'm excited to finally get it. I've just, this has been one of those devices I've wanted for a while. So, it's, like, really cool to finally have it. This is actually a really rare device. And they're very hard to get a hold of. So, we got all of our stuff in there. Yeah, let's see if we can take out the Tama, though, real quickly show it off there we go it's pretty cool pretty pristine overall and the shell's pretty white still I've seen some of these are like they're horribly yellowed you can see a little bit of the yellowing but not bad it's seriously this is like one of the most perfect conditions I've seen that isn't like one of the other colors so overall really great looking just amazing looking I'm excited to finally have that in my set and that'll be our fun run for October, by the way. I'm going to see if I can try getting a case for it. If not, I have soft cases. So no matter what, this thing will be in a case once I do actually start running this. It won't be on a case when I'm recording it or whatever. But Or if I get one of those official ones, it'll be like a flip-up case. It also comes with the little instructions, which we won't get into right now. But overall, pretty cool. Been super excited to finally own one of these. Ever since I ran the Angel, I've been wanting the uh, counterpart to it, which is the Devil. Which is so cool. It's just one of my favorite little aspects of this. Just, ah, it's so cool to have, finally have one. Uh, I do have an Angel. It's just, I don't have the Angel in the packaging, because I usually separate Tamagotchis from their packaging. But, uh... I'm super excited to have this. This has been such a cool, like, desirable one for me. And it's a very different Tamagotchi style. As you can see, all the icons are different in ways and everything. I'll do a quick read-up on it and look through everything. But overall, this will be our final little Halloween run. So be excited for that. It'll actually be a devil and an angel, because why not just have two of them at the same time? I'm going to try getting a case for it though so that'll be the fun of it so you'll see this guy but i'm super excited to have this so this has just been like one of those cool like desirable tamagotchis i've wanted for a while and i'm so glad that uh i was able to get it from the awesome uh, texas group for um uh, tamagotchi stuff because i live in texas because if you don't know nowadays that um if you're on instagram you'll probably notice this but you can join tamagotchi groups very easily and, um, that's what I did. I joined, like, the one near, in my area. I've also joined, like, the main group that is, exists for Tamagotchi stuff, as you've seen before with these guys, because these where these two came from, is the main group. But, uh, like, the main Discord group. But they have the, uh, there's, like, now, like, little communities for Tamagotchi stuff. I haven't gotten to one of the actual meetups yet. I'd love to one day. Just haven't. They always do them on, like, weird days or whatever for me. So, they do, like, plan in advance and stuff like that. Issue is, I usually just work on those days when they're doing the whole meetups and stuff like that. So, hopefully one day I can go in and do the whole meetup thing. 
But for right now, I'm excited. All the people there are super nice as well. So if you are in the Texas area, uh, look into joining that group. Everyone's super nice on that Discord page and everything. And they also, like, discuss, like, events and stuff happening around. So you can learn a lot. It's just one of those cool things. And if you live in one of those areas that does have a group, go check out your own groups as well. Those Your own groups must be pretty awesome as well. I've seen a lot of the videos and images and stuff like that of other groups. And they look awesome as well. So check out your Tamagotchi group if you have one. I wish Digimon would do something like that. I would love to have some Digimon groups, especially for, like, battling and stuff like that. <sighs> one day, hopefully. But for right now, I just wanted to talk about the Devil Gachi because it's just such an amazing thing to finally have. And if we finally have my other hand back in, I took, it's all looking normal. I took everything off and stuff like that, so woohoo! I'm finally feeling better as well! So, yay! Sorry for another late episode, by the way. I uh, got carried away with talking to someone, so... Thank you all for watching, and... Get excited for the Halloween hatch when that happens around. I'll be doing a devil and an angel, so if anyone wants to join with me, at least on the angel side, you can't do that. I'm not going to say join me on the devil side, because these are pretty uncommon. Or I guess you could join me on devil now, because with the, uh, what is it, the unis have the monsters now, don't they? I don't know. Pretty cool things. I guess I should set up, like, a hashtag or something like that and have people, like, tag me in it or something like that. I don't know. One of those things. I need to think about it. <laughs> But that's pretty much it for right now. Thank y'all for watching, and we will see you next time. Bye. And I will be tagging people or linking them all down below, so. Woohoo! Bye. <laughs>